Hello everyone, this is Scott Lowe with IGN here to bring you an unboxing of the Razer Blade, the new model for 2014. So here's the box, let's see what's inside. Right out the gate, you have the blade itself. Now this is a 14 inch gaming laptop, developed by Razer, successor to last year's model, but with a number of big improvements. Uh, most notably, it's new stellar display. It's a 3200 by 1800 display. It's touch screen and it's running Windows 8.1. Under the hood, they have the NVIDIA GTX 870M, a quad-core Intel processor, and eight gigs of RAM standard. Now, the baseline model comes with 128 gigs of storage, uh, which is about $2,200, but it goes up to 512 gigabytes of SSD if you want it. So that's the laptop itself. Let's see what else you get in the box. As is the case with all Razer products, you get a variety of printed materials, talking about the product, a letter from the Razer guy. You have a little blade spec sheet, some information about the Razer Cloud, printed materials, printed materials, a cleaning cloth, which is helpful for a touch screen like that, and stickers if you are a big Razer fanatic. And then you've got power cables, which are to be expected, but then the ultra slim power brick uh, converter for this laptop, which is really, really critical because uh, some competing products have some rather bulking ones, bulky ones. So that's the entire contents of the box, but let's focus on the laptop for a second because that is obviously what you care about most. So you've got the laptop, but for reference, I've got the 13 inch MacBook Pro with Retina display. Uh, and as you can see, they are very small, very similar in form factor. Razer has, uh, you know, quite uh, obviously drawn some, in some inspiration from, App from Apple. Uh, this is a little thicker, but also a little bigger too. This is a, you know, obviously a 13-inch model. This is 14. Um, so, in terms of the keyboards, again, very, very similar. Uh, and it, but you know, of course, the big deal here is that this is a touch screen and this is running uh, Mac, and this is running Windows. So this is just the start of our coverage of the Razer Blade. We're going to have a full review, so stay tuned to IGN.com.